All right, so we're gonna stack the main shaft to this FRO 16210C. Uh, this pertains only to that ratio, that model transmission. We're gonna start with a reverse gear 4303033. Fifth gear 4304750. Third gear 4302506. Second gear, 4302, 421. First gear, 4302, 411. You're gonna have two sliding clutches that are identical, 4302, 265. And your sliding clutch on the end of your main shaft is gonna be a 4304, 014. Keyway, 4302, 316. You're gonna have six of these main shaft washers. These are non-selective, they're all the same. 4302, 258, and you've got a reverse washer here, 4302, 259. Now let's assemble it and see how it goes. We'll start with one washer, slide it down, put a gear on. This is fifth gear, and it's gonna rotate this way, straight down. Washer, 4302, 258. You're turning this and lining this stuff up where this keyway can slip down just like that. It locks this washer into place. Third gear, facing upwards. Washer, turn it. Your keyway can slide through. Straight down like that. You need to put one of these 4302 265s. You're going to turn this in such a way that this keyway and this gear will match. Washer, gear facing down, 4302-421, washer, 4302-411, facing upwards, washer, making sure your key slides through. Reverse gear, this side down. And reverse washer, just like that. Now you're going to put your 4304014 in here. That's going to slide. That's got the keyway cut into the gear where it'll go over this key here. Just like that. And that's how you assemble the main shaft of an FRO 16210C. I want to thank y'all for watching this video. If you'd like to get into depth on this FRO 16210C, you can click the link below and download a full series on how to rebuild an FRO 16210C from start to finish. Thank you for watching.